Well, good morning, everyone. It's Cindy, and it's probably it's probably six thirty in the morning. I have to be at work early. Um, Greg and I went yesterday and did a little vlog, and uh, we were out all day. We went to um, Riverside, and we went to like all part of San Bernardino. So we did everything in one day. We didn't get home till like ten o'clock last night, and left at started at six in the morning. So we went out and did some things that we wanted to do, that we wanted to do two years ago um, for our vlog, and we did it yesterday. So I woke up this morning, and I got to go to work this morning. I got to be at work at 9.45, but I got to do a few things before then. And right now, Prep and Matte by Lancome. It's their primer. So I used the Lancome skincare this morning, and I used their eye cream. I still use my serums. I did use my Genifique serum, so I've used all that, and their moisturizer, the Renegy moisturizer with SPF 15, and then I'm using their Prep and Matte. I do not have their um, setting spray, so I'm going to use the MAC. This is called Fix It Rose. So I always use um, a setting spray over my um, primer. Okay. I say something. When I use the Estee Lauder <sighs> Estee Lauder Futurist Aqua Brilliance, I want to say something. I the watery glowy primer. I noticed when I saw my face on video, I saw that dewy look. And I thought that is what I couldn't believe it. So I went to work. I went to work and I used this um Let's see, today is Wednesday. I used this yesterday. I wore this on Sunday. And I also wore this on the video. And people asked me, what's on your skin? I sold these. I was impressed. So it gave me that little dewy look that people come in for work for. And I, it was this. I know it was. I do have another Estee Lauder primer, which is the Brilliance line, which is one of the originals. I will try that. So I, I got two of these, and I have one of these. So today is Lancome, but I just wanted to give heads up. This what gave me, if you notice a little highlight, I got a comment about it. It was that. And then today, today is Prep and Matte. Put a little bit of roller on my hair because it's been a couple of days because I had my hair colored. And I'm gonna use my top of my hand and I'm gonna use uh, Double Wear Stay In Place Makeup um, 2 and 2 Buff by um, Estee Lauder. It was really warm uh, in San Bernardino and I'll have to admit, this makeup, this foundation stand, I mean, not that it stand, wrong word, it stayed in place on my face, the makeup. It, it did not, it did well. It, Usually makeup starts separating from my nose. It didn't do that. So I'm just using top of my hand and I'm gonna put some on. Should probably put a little concealer, but that's fine. I can put it on top. Um, I, we had a great day, really great day. So I went to visit my dad at the graveside. So I took him some flowers. So I'll set up the video, um, my husband and I, and we hope you enjoy it. All right, let's get some concealer. How have we all been doing? been feeling that fall season it's been absolutely I can feel the crispiness and when I was in LA I felt the crispiness too I wore my beautiful fragrance yesterday it was nice <laughs> something a little different let's get some concealer going I have dark circles in that little trunk area so it really camouflages it let me just move you more this way maybe oh so, so hopefully Greg and I can get that up. I was going to do a mask day, but I end up getting my hair colored. So I couldn't do my mask because I wanted to do a few things with that. I just want to have some fun with my videos and, uh, you know, try to put a little bit. I try to put some more up and, uh, and it, you know, when you see someone give you some really nice comments, it makes you feel that you're giving something special to others. And 
you know, if you can just learn a couple of things new, or even if you just like watching my my channel, or you like watching when Greg it, it when Greg and I are doing things, that it's means a lot to me. It, it really, really does. You this know, is Maybelline Eraser Multi Usage Age. Oh, put the glasses on. I got my contact, but I can't read. Mul uh, eraser Correcting Multi Usage. This is another corrector, but I like. This one's more of a peach color. This is just more as a brightener color. So I'm gonna put this right in here. And I'm going really fast and I take it along and I know all the way. And then I use my regular concealer and I go up and down the nose. And I just feel like this is the area where I like to keep it bright. And I'm almost out of this. But I'm gonna be honest, since I've been using primer more often, my makeup stays on better. And I have to admit, the Estee Lauder make uh, foundation does stay on double wear. I have given hands up, I, I have to say it, it does work. But now I need to find, um, oh, like a really, like a lightweight makeup, like a BB cream or a CC cream. I just ran out of my Mary Kay, phenomenal. It's wonderful, I have, but I need to do an order and I don't do that until December, because I'm almost out of this. Okay. So I'm gonna put some eyebrows down. I need to get my eyebrows done. From here, banging my. You may hear the dogs barking. I can't, it's hard for me. I'm still half asleep, for it not being really daylight. So I know that the season's changing. Got my coffee. Hope you don't mind me drinking my coffee. Okay, I do like this one as well. NYX Thick It, Stick It. And it is a brown thickening mascara. This is Cool Lash Brown. And it actually combs our little, our little hair fibers of our hair brows to set in place. Lancome Primer, Celis Booster XL. I do like the primer. It is in a white. It is used before your mascaras. Okay. I'm going to apply it on top and kind of let it set while I do my eye makeup. I have, let's see, what time is it? I'm going to keep a time because I got to leave and do a few things before I go to work. Okay, put that on. All right. I'm going to use Prime It Boost It Eyeshadow Base by Lancome. We have been out of this. We sold out. It's a nice eyeshadow base. I've been this is my second tube. I'm very impressed with it. I'm going to work it here and apply it on my lids so my eyeshadow lasts longer. See, this this is gonna cover effects. I don't know if they still carry this line. I don't know. I, I used to like it because they have this for this, this one side, and then they had this for the, but I haven't seen that. I need to look up on the website. I don't think I saw it. And if they have it, I haven't seen it in their stores because it used to be sold in um, Alta. Okay, so I'm gonna take, again, as you know, I always pat, pat, so I pat and pat. It was, I, we were in San Bernardino. Oh, I put it like right in through here, right here. If you could feel your bone at the end, not in the uh, hollow, but in through here. I always say, I never know. We used to do this in the hollow days back in the 80s and 90s, but that doesn't mean it won't come back. Um, you've heard me say that too. Go along the nose. Just a little bit, I just, it's just a little pat, pat along the nose a little bit. Okay, do that here because I may need it in a minute and keep my glasses here. Um, okay, I'm gonna use medium beige, bare minerals, medium beige powder mineral powders this has an spf and i don't think i've never said this before because this does have an spf 
SPF of 15 sunscreen, and I keep forgetting to mention that. And I'm so happy I was looking at the bottom after my video. And that's why people bought this, because it has SPF, and I keep forgetting that. And I need to remember that when I talk to people. I'm going to get their brush. I'm getting a little... I'm getting a travel size of this. It's on right now at Macy's. So I'm going to order, get that. Where is that? For my, when I travel and things. All right, and it does come with a little brush, so I'm excited. I would, I want to use their brushes. We've been out for a while. Okay, so you can, because these are just not the same. Let's swirl it. This is just a fluffer brush, but it's not a kabuki brush. And I want to get what I'm supposed to use with it. Trying not to buy a lot, but... It's not a kabuki, so I tell my husband I need to do that. And I try to, uh, I've seen when they use the kabuki brush, I was like impressed. So go swirl around. So just remember that Bare Minerals has an SPF. So I have an SPF on my moisturizer. Um, I have an SPF, I don't not have an SPF in my foundation. It does not have a, an SPF. And I have an SPF right now. I have to admit, Estee Lauder does not have an SPF. I don't, it doesn't say on it. I always say if it doesn't say it, <laughs> probably doesn't have it. And I took my Estee Lauder Double Wear makeup, matte makeup, and that for my touch-ups throughout the day, and that really lasted. So I'm going to wear this one because it's more fall season. This one to me is a little bit more evening look. I don't know. This one is Par Parian, Parsian style. Parsian style? It sounds very French. Okay. Let me just get excess powder here. Excess powder, powder. Got a little more powder. Okay. All right, let's see what we got going on here. I'm going to hear my dogs. I've got to clean my brushes, so I need a... I think this is an old tart. <laughs> my daughter gave me this old tart. Um, I, I use everything. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to use is I'm going to go with this, and I don't know what color, but this is a quadruple eyeshadow palette. I'm going to go with the lighter color. I'm going to see today when I go there if they still carry it. If you got a Lancome, you know, if you have this from a Lancome gift, I'm going to go all over. Use them. They're great for traveling, and it allows you to try on their eyeshadows. I have to admit, when I use the Lancome eyeshadows, they go on um, really soft, I'll be honest with you. They're not dry. I'm gonna just go all over the eyelid. I just feel like I'm a little tired right now because I didn't get to bed till like one o'clock in the morning. So I just want to put some lightness around my eye. Okay. I'm gonna go with the pink color because you know I like the little shimmer. So I'm just gonna pat, pat, and I'm just gonna apply it right here on the lid. And you can see I apply lightly. I always do. I just apply lightly because, again, I can always add more as I go. Okay. The next one I'm going to take is the, it's like a gray color. It looks like a gray color. I'm going to take that. I'm going to put it in a little, little contour here. People call it transition. Some people call it contour. That. Um, then I'm doing my little, what is it called, the windshield wipers. <laughs> I like the really close, but then I go back here and I like this a little bit better for some reason. I just feel like I see more in my eye area. And I, I still, I still take it in through here. You know, some people just keep it right in through here. I still have the old days. I still bring it down. 
I just do. I always take my little sponge. Arms pat pat. Working with two brushes. And this brush, I don't even know where I got this from. I can't even read it anymore. When you, when you buy really good brushes, they last forever. And then it even faded out the, the name. I just blend a lot. That's why I like to do. I know what I forgot to do. I know what I forgot to do. It is. My daughter got it for me. It is Stay Naked by Correcting correcting Conceal. She got it at a good deal. I wasn't at work. And uh, she got it for me. She's another one. She's a concealer queen. This one has a little matte finish. Yeah, This would be a Megan type. She likes the matte finish. I always like to bring it down a little bit. Yeah. Should have put this on first. I always do. Okay, there we go. In case I have a little fallout of eyeshadow or anything like that, it's taken away. Okay. I may have to come back and finish doing my makeup. Okay, so then I'm going to go with, see this little dark color right here? I'm just going to take that and just apply it a little V right in through here, just in the corner, just for a little touch. Right there. Just a little. I feel like my husband's going to say, are you ready to go? I'll be like in just a minute. I'm trying to be quick here. Again, I'm going to go back with the little white here and I'm just going to put it along my eyebrows. A little, and I kind of blend everything. This is Estee Lauder Double Wear Waterproof Gel Eye Pencil, and it's Onyx 01 Bridge. Not... Maybe I need to look up a little bit. I'll go this way. Just at the bridge. I'm going to go in the, eye, in the eyelid. And I go right in there. I kind of set it in there. I hold this with my finger and I set it right in the, I think you can see it right in there. Do you see that? And I just pat it along. And I always look back, make sure. Okay. And then I take this little brush. Uh, where are you? I think it's being ah, this one. This is an eyebrow duo, but I use the angle part for this. And this is by Elf. All right, let's see. I just take it, I kind of like set it in place. My angle needs to go like that. Okay. And I just set it in the lashes like that. 
Where is Togo gone? I think it's like kind of like stapling it. Yes, this is what I'm going to do. When I was young, I used to put a pencil on. I'm going to use a setting spray. And then I'm just going to set it with an eyeshadow. So I'm going to take that dark color so it doesn't smear throughout the day. And then I just have the shimmer underneath it. Yeah, just a bit. Okay, my Chiseido Eye Curler. This is Lancome Black Hypnosis Drama Mascara. I do have to go get my, I think it's the Maybelline mascara that I use under. I need to go get some. Okay. I think this mascara is about done. Another one that I've used up. It's gonna go in my empties. Sure. I think I have Lancome blusher. I do. All right, just a touch bronzer, just a tip, because I have a still. I'm not a still. I got a Lancome one, just a tip, very very small amount. It would even out my skin, just a tip. And that is by Lancome. All right, blusher. This is Rose Frisk, and it is by Lancome. More of a fall color. Use my Lancome double, double-ended brush that they don't sell. Okay, so I'm going to pat it, and I'm going to apply it right in here. And just pat it on. And probably a little too much, but I'll blend that out. Okay. And just pat, pat. And I only go up to here and then up to here. Go over just to blend it in. Now, perfect. Okay, that's that. <clears throat> I'm gonna get my highlighter. Halo, Hello Halo Blush Lightener. I do like this, it was pretty reasonable because it has two different shimmer and for some reason I'm always going with the lighter one. So I'm just gonna pat on that and I always realize I don't have a mirror. So I'm gonna take that and I'm just gonna go around right in here like a little halo, right on the top of the cheeks, and you can see that. And I go along the middle. All right, another sip of my coffee. I can hear the dogs. Okay, I'm gonna spray again. I forgot to do my lip primer. Well, I better do that right now. I do not have a lip primer with a line comb, but I will use I'll use Mac. And this is spice.
This is called Fake Awake. <laughs> and that's what I need right now. And I'm going to use that in the inner the, uh, water line to open up my eye area. And it kind of like takes the redness, like brightens up my eye area. I just feel like it does. If I go out at night, I'll probably use a black liner, but it's during the day and my eyes are a little red from the wind. Eh, probably from the smog, a little bit pollution, pollution from the wind. Okay, there goes that. And then I'm gonna use the Dewy Set by Anastasia. I love this. It doesn't go on like a shimmer, but I do like. Oh, I like the way it fans out like a, an umbrella. Like, oh, I love this. I always will use this. I love this to as a fix it. I use this with for eye. Use it with um eyeshadow brush. You know to line. I love it for to prep my face makeup before my face makeup, and then I use this to set, and then I even use this again. I love those two. Those are my favorite. All right. I'm going to go get ready real quick, and then I'll be right back. Okay. I'm not done with my hair yet, but I took down the rollers to give you a little, little bit of height. <laughs> I, my husband goes, we got to go. We'll, you'll be right back. Okay. So what did I forget? I forgot my wet and wild photo focus <laughs> translucent powder. Ah, I'm in a rush. I just used about that much. And I twirl my powder around, my brush around, and then apply it, and then just swirl it around. So I've got to put my lipstick on, but I'll do it in the car. Or maybe I'll wait till I get back. People just, <laughs> no, I'll put it on right now. Okay, I just need to blend that all in. I colored my hair, I went a little bit dark. I like going dark in the fall and lighter in the, a little bit light in the summer and um, spring and summer. Let me see if I can make it up. Called I Love Pop and it's by Clinique. So I'll use that. And I'll come back and finish my hair. Get that done. And did this lip injection, and this is a lip injection extreme, and this is pink punch. Apply that on, just on top. It'll burn a little bit, but it'll it's supposed to get more like you had your lips done, but it adds a little plump to it. I'll let that sit, and I'll be right back. Ready for work. And I have Lancome, Estee Lauder, I have different uh, makeup. I will put the prod product descriptions of the items that I use, but I wanna thank all of you for being with me and me coming into your homes and allowing me to apply my makeup today before I go to work. I want you all to have a great day. I will get the video up with Greg and I, and I hope you're gonna like it. It was a fun day for us. We needed to get away and just enjoy. Go see my dad, take some, some flowers, but we also did some other things. And appreciate all of you. Appreciate you always being here. And I appreciate your support. Okay. I want you all to have a great day. Take care. Love you all. And I will see you on my next video. Oh, and don't forget, subscribe if you like this video. And like. And if you want to share it, that would be great. Comments. Okay. Bye.